North Carolina State Highway Patrol is now using artificial intelligence and cameras to catch distracted truck drivers. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Rod Carter. I'm Angela Taylor. Thanks for being here. CBS 17's Haley Fixler digging into this new technology. She joins us live with a closer look at how it works. Haley. Well, Rod, Angela, each of these three devices have a camera that can shoot directly into a windshield, which, as you can tell with a normal camera, is very hard to do. But this technology is so advanced that even in bad weather or bright sun like today, it can see whether or not I have a phone in my hand while I'm sitting at the wheel. People we spoke with say they have mixed emotions about technology being used this way. Stopping distracted drivers in their tracks. North Carolina State Highway Patrol using new technology to make interstates safer. They've purchased three heads-up devices from the Australian company AccuSensus. These cameras take pictures through the windshield of a truck. Artificial intelligence reports back to troopers if the driver was holding a phone in their hands or not wearing a seatbelt. Law enforcement will be stationed ahead of those cameras and be able to stop the drivers if they get an alert from the system. Drivers could get fined up to $100. I'm happy that they're trying to find more ways to you know, make the highway safer. I feel like too many people are complacent with their own ability to multitask, and there's been a lot of highway accidents. Chris White has been driving trucks for 10 years. At first, he was on board with the idea. If it scares people into driving more safely, then because that's really what it comes down to. Then we told him it's just for commercial vehicle drivers like himself. No, I don't think that's okay. State Highway Patrol says the law for truck drivers is strictly hands-free. For people in passenger cars, the law specifies drivers just can't text or read emails. Others we spoke with have privacy concerns. That's my privacy. It's supposed to be privacy. It's like they put cameras in the bracelets. When they, you know, when, they, when you change clothes. The photos won't be shared with any other law enforcement group. And while controversial, there are some high hopes this technology will prevent more crashes and even deaths. Now, the devices will be moved around in frequently highly trafficked areas. Now, State Highway Patrol says they were set up in Hickory last week, and in just a 30-minute period, they had 5 to 10 violations, and they are not currently sharing where those devices are with me right now. Live in Wade County, Haley Fixler, CBS 17 News. Similar to ShotSpotter, they don't right. tell you where those, those are either. So, interesting. Okay, Haley, thank you.